What's up, everybody? Burning Ernie here. Um, uh, hope everybody's having a good uh, night wherever you are. I think it's like six o'clock out here in California. Um, more importantly, I got a sauce for you guys to review. It would be right here. Boom. Tiger sauce. And what struck me really weird here, it says like Tiger sauce original. It says, okay, you can try. It says right here. Uh, tr for meat, seafood, everything else, can you stand up to the sweet heat? To me, that's a bold statement. We're trying to stand up to the, 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 the bold heat. Okay. So, um, on the back, it says right here, Tiger Sauce Original packs a fierce flavor in a, in a balanced yet complex sauce that is slightly sweet with a touch of heat. Okay, and then on the bottom, on the other one, at the bottom it says, Unleash the sweet heat as a condiment, as an ingredient, as a marinade or cooking sauce. Shake well before um, using. Okay, so let's look at the ingredients. Right, here. we'll look at the ingredients. Okay, so um, the ingredients are um, cayenne pepper, the first ingredient. Okay, uh, sugar, distilled vinegar. I'm, I'm assuming since the sugar is second, that's where the sweetness comes from but okay cayenne pepper sugar distilled vinegar water salt crushed red peppers um xanthan gum uh chili peppers not the red hot ones but you know that you know what i'm saying um chili peppers caramel color sodium benzoid uh, to preserve the preserve freshness um, hydrated corn, um, hydrated corn protein. I never seen that in a sauce before. Hydrated corn protein. Well, um, maybe let me know in the comments below if you ever heard that before in a sauce. Hydrated corn protein. Um, uh, tamarind extract, natural flavor. Contains anchovy, oregano. Uh, cumin, garlic powder, and it says right there in bold on the bottom, you can see, uh, contains fish. Okay, I don't mind eating seafood, but I never had anchovies before. Um, so, what we're going to do is obviously clearly crack this bad boy up, and I'm assuming there's going to be a flow restrictor on this one, but let's, um, let, let's see, let's see, um, Give me a second. There we go. Okay. Boom. And I'm assuming there's gonna be a flow restrictor, so let me let me see if this is right or am I wrong. And oh holy moly, it's not. Hmm. It just smells like uh Jeez, what, what, what would I say? It smells, it smells like, um, I don't know, it smells like just like a, like a regular table sauce. I mean, what am I getting here? Hold on. Hold on. Um, I'm confused what I'm getting. What, on the ingredients I read, I'm not getting cayenne. I'm getting like, I don't know, like very, maybe it's the sugar, I'm not sure, but anyways, I, I, I can't really tell, guys, but here we go, shake it up, I got my spoonie, and let's, 
And I like how it's sauce. If you can see it, look all, all like the good little seeds in there. That's pretty cool. Yeah. That could be that could be a good sauce, bad sauce, but okay. I'm sorry. But okay, here we go. Burning Ernie. Let's let's pour and let's uh let's see if we burn. Oof. Okay, see? Looks like blood, so whatever. Here we go. Cheers. Definitely, I'm getting the sweet heat. What they're saying. Um. Yeah, I want more. It, it's. Um. Much like the the review I did yesterday with the um. The um. The Thai sweet chili type thing, but it has a similar vibe. It's like. It's it's like I'll, I'll I'll tell you this right now. Hold on, guys. Boom. Okay. One more time. Um, I know exactly what it tastes. Um, I don't know if you guys remember the candy. Um, this Mexican candy. I forgot what it's called. Um, oh, man. I apologize. I can't remember what it's called, but there's. It tastes. I'll just say. I'll just say this. It tastes like the Mex Mexican, Me like Mexican candy. That's what it tastes like to me. Like just me like Mexican candy. Like um. Ah, uh, I I I apologize, guys, but I can't remember what it's called. But um, like just Mexican, me like just me uh, Mexican candy. No, it, it it's. You know, I when I heard that, like you know, uh, can you stand up? Can you stand up to the sweet heat? I was like, that's a bold statement. Um, good sauce. Um, I agree. I, I use it on, uh, yeah, definitely seafood. You know, just like stuff like that. I I, I could agree, but um, not hot. I'll I'll give it maybe. The, I mean, when I had when I had it, um. There, there was about um, maybe a, a little sting. It almost, it almost like the taste exactly the same as the sauce I reviewed uh, yesterday. Um, not more. Uh, same thing because the sauce I reviewed yesterday had cayenne. This has cayenne. So let's um, let's the the let's just it, it almost the same surprisingly, but um um. That's it. Um, you know, exactly what they said. Like seafood, you know, I, I eat egg rolls. If you want to like make some like um, like marinated chicken or something like that, and then have some chicken and put that all over it, like, and that'd be good. You know, like marinated like chicken wings and then boom, put it on there. That that'd be good. Um, but um, yeah, flavor wise, it's really good sauce. I didn't really get the anchovies, you know, but whatever. Um, with, with, with that said, flavor wise, I think I said something, can't remember. Flavor wise, I'll, I'll give it, you know, same thing as before, like a five. Heat, heat wise, a low one, but uh, with that said, burning Ernie here, wishing you guys, you know, uh, like uh, you know, wishing you guys, you know, happy, 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 and not like Randy said, be happy, happy, joy, joy. But um, I wish you guys everybody happy, good times. Everybody says safe. Burning her in here and signing off. Love you guys, and boom.